okay, it's, hey, it's Brooke Hoover, and I'm looking at uh, drum pattern A04 on my Alesis or Zoom Rhythm Track RT123. This one's pretty cool. This one sounds like uh, kind of like Devo meets Iggy Pop or something. I'm gonna do some chords, but I want you to solo. I'll, I'll play the riff that's on the bass part on the drum machine, and then I'm gonna play some chords, but I want you to play solo. So solo, E blues scale, like. Stuff like that, you know? Alright, here I go on the on the riff. You play solo. So what I, in case you're curious, I was doing an E chord and lifting it up like that. I'm just lifting up these two fingers here. Middle and ring. And I'm trying to hit those two strings. The A and the D string. See why it's important to be able to hit the right strings. And you gotta understand if I'm kind of cranky about that, Students, you know, I'm like, okay, make sure on your E flat chord you only hit the four middle strings. And the student goes, I'm like, whoa, that's not good. So that's why I want you to be tight with your picking hand so that you hit the right strings. That's really important. Okay, so back to soloing. Remember your E blues scale is just E, G, A, B flat. B, D, and E. You can do it on the big string. Just go up and down the scale. Then you can crisscross across the neck like this. And do some bands. Okay, back to the rhythm. You solo. One, two, ready, go! Keep soloing.
Okay, so notice how I'm not using a guitar strap. That's why I want your hand back here so you can maybe get a grip on your bridge, man. It's kind of cool. It kind of feels good. I'm slamming my hand into that bridge pretty hard. No strap. So if your hand is up like this, you know, it's like, wow. In my opinion, that's... This is better. <laughs> I don't know. I hate to I hate to pick on your right hand technique, but you know if you're up here trying to pick, you're you're gonna hit the wrong strings. So come on back a little bit, not all the way to the end, but back pretty far. Palm here, roll forward, you're set. Right across here. And that will fix a whole bunch of stuff. That's all I'm trying to do is help you with that. Well, that was fun. I really like that jam. That's, again, that's Zoom Rhythm Track RT123 Drum Pattern A04 at 120 beats a minute. I just turn it on and play it and see what it does and just play along. It's really fun. Good practice. All right. I'm going to be doing more of these, so I want you to be ready to solo. Be working on your E blues scale. And we are jamming, and that's cool. Thanks a lot. Bye.